thank you, Amber. And that was the perfect lead in to our interview because I am joined by Lindsay Neff and she is the vice president of the Rocket City Trash Pandas. And she's talking everything Trash Pandas today. We got some cool stuff out here. I love this little I brought thing. props. Hey. Yes. hey. <laughs> so first of all, welcome, welcome, welcome to the show. Thank you. I appreciate you having me. Well, we are huge Rocket City Trash Panda fans here, but you all recently celebrated a huge milestone. You had your one millionth fan. Talk to us about that and what it meant to you. It was so amazing. Uh, we crowned our one millionth fan on Saturday, last Saturday, and it couldn't have been better. Um, she was so excited. The crowd was all into it. Uh, everyone who came to that game had an opportunity to be the one millionth fan. And as we calculated who was that ticket winner coming through the gate, we announced it live on the field before the fireworks. And we had confetti and smoke <laughs> and lights. And it was just awesome. Great experience. She was so excited. I love that. And you hit on a key word. I want to talk about experience because as soon as you walk through the gates, it is like so overwhelming. There are so many things going on everywhere you turn. How do you all come up with this stuff and the cool promotions? We have a great team I and mean, we're always talking and brainstorming and trying to come up with what's the new exciting thing that we can bring a smile to someone's face. But really from the time you park your car until the time you leave the gate, we want you to have a great experience. Leave your worries at the gates, leave them outside, and when you come in, we want it to be Disney World for you. We want you to just smile, laugh, have a great time, and not care who wins or loses at the end of the game. That really doesn't matter. We just want to see if you catch a t-shirt, get a giveaway, watch the fireworks, or just, you know, have a nice food or drink with your friends. I, and I love that, because I recently saw the, uh, the hot dog launcher. <laughs> Oh, that yes. thing is so, if you all have not seen it, you need to go to their social media page. It is awesome. It so is. cool. Yeah. So let's talk about some of those promotions coming up because this Tuesday, we got to dust off those blue suede shoes because mm -hmm. you have something cool coming up. We have Elvis night on Tuesday, so we're going to have people come and perform in the pregame and throughout the game to try to be crowned our number one Elvis of the Trash Pandas. And they're going to win a, an experience to go to Graceland, have an Elvis VIP package, and um, just have a great fun uh, reward for coming out and trying to be an Elvis impersonator. So if you're out there and you want to join and you want to try to perform on the field, reach out to us. There's still some time and we have maybe one or two openings still. So that'll be a great time on Tuesday. And we have a lot of stuff going on throughout the week. Oh, what else do you have? So there is the Lunaticos. The Rocket City Lunaticos is our way to try to embrace the Hispanic culture and community I here. And we have this jersey that we'll be wearing on Thursday. We we have a yard mug that you can get oh, as you come cool. in for the 1,500 adults 21 and older, and these will get you $5 margaritas throughout the entire game. So that's really cool. We have a new Lunaticos cap that <laughs> the teams will not be wearing, <laughs> but it's it. available in the store. Um, and then, of course, we have Princess Night on Friday. Yeah. We have Dog Day on Wednesday. So if you have a dog and you haven't brought your dog to the ballpark, Wednesday is a great day to always bring your dog. Princess Night on Friday. They'll have these little wands available for the girls. I think you really like this, so I'm going to yeah. leave that behind with you. Oh, thank you. My daughter's <laughs> going to love this. Yes. Oh. So when you go home, you'll be a rock star tonight. Exactly. <laughs> and then we have on Saturday, it's National Wine Day. It is also a fireworks night, but we have a sampling mug that you can purchase and uh, go out throughout the ballpark, and you can sample five different wines in this mug and keep the mug behind. Um, and then there's just a lot of things happening. Memorial Day, oh. we have another great homestand the following day of week in June. So... We never have a lack of things going on at the ballpark. I see. And unfortunately, we are out of time, but I want to do this now because you're here. So you have to promise me that you're going to come back because you have so many more things coming up. Absolutely. I'll be back anytime you want. All right. Well, let the viewers know where they can go to find out more information. Trashpandasbaseball.com or tptix.com. Get it from the source. It's the best way to go. Awesome. Lindsay, I want to thank you so much for coming on. You're great. This stuff thank is cool, you. too. Make sure you go check out a game, all right? We'll be right back after the break. Thank <laughs> you.